giving people all my teas. Like, this thing is the best thing since sliced bread. Now, we're not breaking the bank today. Hey, my loves, welcome back to my channel. My name is Grace, and my channel's name is Grace Lane. If you're tuning in for the first time, you are welcome. We're particularly going to talk about affordable products that actually work on the natural hair. Now, we're not breaking the bank today. Affordable products, and they work just as good as your regular shmegola products let's jump right into the video so let's start from the most important one which is pre pulling particularly i never used to pre pull until when my hair fell apart and i realized that it is important to actually pre pull your hair so pre pull basically entails you adding a product to your hair and gradually gradually detangling it one product that is super affordable and it goes a long way is your regular conditioner in the house yes put it in a bottle of water make it a little bit thick and it works just as good as any of the pre pulls out there the conditioner has a way of softening up your hair, hair follicles making it easy for you to run your hands through so you don't necessarily have to buy anything you just have to use your conditioner at home now moving on to cleansing your hair we all know that shampoo is very very important and for me I don't fear any sulfate. I don't think we should be scared about sulfate. I don't think it's a terrible product to use. But personally, the Tresemme shampoo, the 7X moisture, is so good. Like, I don't know if anyone has tried it. Leave it in the leave your um, review in the description box. But that shampoo, I'm currently using it, and it is so good. When I tell you it is so good, it is flipping good it has so much moisture like i was so surprised that it was giving me the same feel i would get from my shea moisture jamaican black black castor oil um, con um shampoo this is literally a dupe for that shampoo so if you don't have shea moisture money we definitely will have trust me money and this shampoo best believe is really really good it doesn't strip off your hair your hair actually feels moisturized after using it like is that good initially i did not want to tell you guys but i feel like i've been bringing out good products i've been trying good products i've been showing you cool products that have been good so i won't say something good and i won't tell y'all we besties over here <laughs> so the second um shampoo i would always recommend is the aussie aussie moist shampoo this shampoo is really 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 good and you get quantity like you can use the shampoo for at least six months and you know that you're not gonna run out like it's gonna last you for at least half a year and it's really good now these products don't have the best of ingredients but like i said they work like your hair is gonna be soft as in value for your money very little goes a long way hands down these two shampoos the trust me and the aussie Moving forward to conditioners, initially when I went natural, I mm, I wasn't really into conditioners because I was like, mm, what the hell, I can always deep condition my hair. But when I started using conditioners, that was when I kind of knew the importance. If your hair is a type that easily gets tangled, I have super curly hair and it easily get tangled. When I started conditioning my hair, the first thing I'm going to recommend is of course the Tresemme 7x Moisture Conditioner. This thing is the best thing since sliced bread, as in that's on period. It makes your hair super soft. You can comb through almost immediately after applying the conditioner. Like that's how good it is. The second one I'm going to recommend is the Mega Growth Conditioner. This conditioner, baby, baby. Oh, it makes your hair so soft. The other day I was having a conversation with my friend and she was telling me that, oh, she really likes the conditioner. I was like, I just kept quiet because it's always nice when other people try stuff and they tell you and you're like yes girl yes girl like it's really really that good these two conditioners are the best conditioners that are affordable in a very good price range and the um, details to this will be in the description box this video is not sponsored now for deep conditioners best believe i have tried a lot of deep conditioners and i'm just gonna say it i haven't found any <laughs> affordable deep conditioner that is really really good for me, the best I have used is the Shea Moisture's JBCO line. That is the best I have tried. I have tried other companies that I will not mention. Just They just sat on my hair and they were like, eh, they're just, just there. 
best believe the Shea Moisturize Jamaican Black Castor Oil Line Mask best deep conditioner hands down looking forward to leave-in conditioners leave-in conditioners for me is like it's like i won't say it's a foundation but it is what keeps you sane <laughs> every month there's this conditioner that that i found oh god it is the original coconut oil something 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 but this is really good i'm just giving people all my teas like for the greater part of the year my hair was going through a lot and i almost cut it off slash relaxed it but like ever since I changed to these products, like my hair has been flourishing. It has been really, really good. For me, this particular leave-in conditioner is a dupe for the Shea Moisture JBCO um, leave-in conditioner that everybody loves. It also gives you that silk feeling you get from the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Curl Smoothie. So it's like a two-in-one. And it's quite thick to an extent. You get like, it goes a long way. Like this leave-in conditioner baby baby if you have some money to splurge and you want to get something higher than that best believe the next living conditioner that is super super good two of them but they're a bit pricey the kinky curly and the share moisture jbco living conditioner these two conditioners your hair will thank me for it <laughs> That's how good it is. Oftentimes, a lot of people have had conversation with me about their edges not going well, not doing this, not doing that. And the first thing I'm going to say is you have to limit how much tension is around here. And another product I would recommend that is really affordable is the Dr. Miracle's um, Nape and Temple Ointment. That one is really, really good. It is super affordable. If you have extra money to splurge, then you can go for wild growth. These two oils I would recommend for hair growth. Another oil that is super affordable, which is very common in our natural hair community, is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil, um, but the one with peppermint inside. Peppermint has a way of stimulating hair growth. Aside the cooling feeling it gives, it does actually help stimulate hair growth and it's also super affordable another super affordable growth adveric herbs so those ones that have a mixture of everything they have a way of stimulating your hair growth personally i'm still finding my way through them and i will definitely give you a company that personally i will recommend once i'm done with my trial and errors thank you guys so much for tuning in today i hope you enjoyed this video leave in the comment section products that you have used your ride or dies are super affordable so you help you you can help a lady out there who is trying to also get um affordable products that she can also use so let's help each other um thank you guys so much for tuning in today until i come again next time see your girl Christine. bye y'all